we now return to Let's Play SimCity. So, uh, one thing I have decided uh, is to pause because uh, we got some health issues. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and spread out our park situation here. And so that means I'm going to have to recreate this park area, which uh, will take just a minute. So we'll put that over there. And we'll do a basic, what is that, pond? Actually, it's under nature. Nature pond. Right there. How about we, how about we do something like that instead this time? And then we got uh, this medium path park, which goes something like that. And then we do the basic pavilion, something like that. Okay, and now we can just get rid of this. Yes. Oh yes, and there's a short tree row that I have forgotten. Uh, nature, nature. Ooh, I have apparently built this differently this time. I cannot get that one in there. Is it this? Hmm. That's interesting. Why is that one bigger? I don't know. But it uh, has removed that, so I guess. Anyway. So, what we're going to do here is uh, probably put one. See, that'll take care of this area, and then we'll put one in here, and then we'll put one in here, and then we'll put one here, and that'll allow me to have apartments up in this side, and we actually need apartments, we do need a few apartments, so we'll go ahead and put a few apartments. Well, we'll put residentials in there so that they become apartments, because what I'm going to do after that, well, we won't do it just yet, but uh, this whole area here is going to be a medium density road on this side and we'll keep the rest of that out so just to remind myself that's what this is going to be we'll go ahead and upgrade this it's medium right there and we may as well get that one too so people will go speeding and then they'll hit dirt so that'll be good uh, that'll pick up again uh, let's do well you know what just so I remind myself once again I gotta keep leaving myself little hints and clues here. Um, that is actually not at all where that. Whoa, that is the wrong key. Um, this one is actually where I want that to go. So you guys can stay there, and then you guys can go up here, and that'll allow me to have some suburbia along the edges here too, because that's where the park will extend to. So that'll be nice. Um, and I'm assuming that that's not gonna be too big of a problem. Okay. So, another thing I'd thought about uh, was doing swapping these so that we kind of have the uh, the town hall more in the middle of the commercial, but then that means this avenue is going to go down this way, and it's not really something I want, uh, mostly because it's not going to fit things well. Uh, as it is, things are not going to fit well anyway, because, well, I don't know, maybe they will. Yeah, they're totally not. Um, they'll fit well if we do... Oh, right, that's what I was going to do. I was going to have them go this way to this way so that they develop along the side roads. Well, in that case, that could be an option um, because what I was afraid of was going to happen was that I was going to have to put uh, like trees along there, and I didn't want... Since that's going to be where all the, uh, the big apartments are going to po pop up, I didn't want that to be where... Now, hold on a minute, though. That's not necessarily going to be true because they take up this whole thing, so maybe they won't get that either. Mm. Okay, now well, maybe that's not going to work out either way. Um, if I took out this road, I would have very long... Yeah, this boy, that really screws with things, doesn't it? It really doesn't make it go well, but uh, we might end up taking out big chunks of this anyway for amusement park space. So anyway, let's never mind that. Let's just keep it over here. Um, I, I think in most towns I've been to, at least most uh, most small cities around here, um, your town hall tends to be kind of in the downtown commercial center, but uh, actually in my hometown it's pretty close to the residential actually, downtown. It's a very compacted downtown. Right, um, another thing I wanted to look at real quick. 
this is a different station. That's what I thought. So this one will fit my regular, but remember, I want to do European fancy dances. So um, that might be a little bit different. Is this gonna? Uh, no. So it's got to. It's got to go horizontal, and you can actually see where it attaches to which sucks, because I built this little area specifically so that I could get these guys to come right there and it would fit nice and be good. But I do I do want to have the European stuff, I do want to have all the interesting things. Unfortunately we can't have nice things. So anyway, uh, we have the hospital, or the clinic at the very least, to put down. Um, I think we can probably afford to put that right here since that'll be pretty much central to all residential. And in fact, if I was really going to do that, I could put the clinic like right back here because I would really gain access to pretty much, since this is going to be all residential, why don't we do that instead? We'll put it behind Town Hall here, um, which means we're going to do ha like a half and half. But if we do a half and half, what am I going to put in there? Probably going to have to be, see if I put it in low density parks. Can I put in a low density? I might be able to fit in something like that. I don't know that I, I don't think I want to do tech. I don't think I want tech build up. We will try to keep the franchise of uh, of uh, Megacore out of here, and we'll, uh, we'll we'll just keep it high density and and all that stuff, but not with the tech, if I can help it. Now, we're going to have to put in education towards tech so that this terrible industry here actually pops up to something decent that doesn't overly pollute, at least to the very next level, because then it won't be so bad. Um, but anyway, uh, enough talking, because that's all I seem to do anymore. And that'll go. So, that works for them. And clinic, right. So, anyway, lower that down. So we'll probably put the clinic, like, right here. Um, I think so, right there, and then ambulances. Well, actually, I don't know. If I put it closer to here, well, you know, the ambulance will... And I can still extend to the back, anyway. And then we'll ambulances along the, the sideway. Okay, I like that. We'll put that there. And still major demand regionally looks like oh hey lots of low wealth locally so we'll probably put that see I can't really I suppose if I did put commercial along here just poke, poke commercial in just a little bit kinda has to be in a way okay we'll do it that way Now, really, though, this, I think. See, because I think this is gonna where I'm going to have the townhouses. I think we'll split off two, I don't know, maybe three apartments. Something like that. A lot of people are unhappy. Land value just went to shit, so that's why. But uh, that's pretty much par for the course. So I have to figure out other parks, and that's going to be a little bit of a doozy because they don't fit well. Which is a pain. I mean, we can put things, these big things, like uh, skate parks, actually. We can probably put that one right here, um, since this is a little bit more central to downtown, and I feel like, especially being closer to uh, what will sort of be the, uh, the higher density stuff, I feel like maybe that'll fit there a little more appropriately. We can always put this out here, way out here. That would actually boost up there. Um, anyway, I gotta, I gotta put, uh, yeah, okay, so it is this one right here. So let's put in a park here, a skate park here. I think that if I, cause that other one's gonna be right here, so I probably want this one to be a little bit closer, further away, because I think if it gets too close, it might bleed into what will be the apartment, so go something like that. And then, skate park is there. Anything else that I can add to this? Not that way. Oh, I could just put in a big long path. How about we put in a windy path though? Although if I put in a windy path, can I still stick that in? Probably not. I guess we'll find out. 
No, but, you know, that's good enough. Nice little walkway, nice little park. Works for me. Now that is a bit of an issue because the uh, the density is pulling into here. I'm afraid this is going to start causing... It, it's totally going to cause that, actually. That is the problem with putting in big parks like this, is that they compound each other and bleed. And I do not want these to be condos in the middle of that. So actually, we might just have to pull that out. This is hard. This is actually very difficult to balance this out. I don't like it. And I don't think that's going to share a field with that either. I think that might be too big. So how do I get other parks in here? What happens if I get rid of this? Let's let this go. Okay, and it does shrink the land value a bit. Although this is still... Because of the buildings themselves, putting that in. Okay. So what if I put in something like a barbecue, my favorite little go-to? Yeah, I didn't think that was going to fit. Okay, well, not so. What about a little one? Like, if I put in a little park, and it's really unfortunate that I can't get it to snap to the other side of that road, but if I put in a little park... Okay, that does... that ropes it in a little bit. I like that. And we'll put a basic uh, barbecue and playground. Oh, no playground. It does put the land value out, but it's at least higher land value than none, which is effectively what we're going for there. And I really actually need to turn that off. Okay. And I don't know. I guess we'll grab these. The very unfortunate thing about just plopping down trees is that it's, it doesn't really fill in. I could put trees in. So I have to put in something like this. And then put in that sort of... Yeah. I, I think this is a little bit crowding here probably be better pushed over, but I'm just afraid of what that's going to actually do spreading into this territory. Even just that little bit of pixels, I think, is going to push it too far. Although, see, now we're not getting these guys going. Although, as they build up, they I think they spread their own. I might be wrong about that. Do I maybe need to push that down here instead? Still low wealth, that's good. Mm. I'm nervous about that because I don't want it to connect up here. This is going to be. I mean, we've already got one here. Just thanks to having that clinic there. In fact, that clinic is going to cause me all kinds of grief. Not necessarily. If I keep this kind of commercial. And I think having a majority would wipe this out anyway. I'm hopeful that's going to be true. Anyway, what uh, what are we demanding here? Still got lots of medium wealthers that we can put in here. So we'll be looking at that over here. Uh, so now I guess we can put one of these in. Kind of try to keep it a little bit... Uh, a little bit different. What kind of sports park can we put in over here? Tennis court? It's a little bourgeois, I feel, but uh, maybe it'll work. Okay. Now, we probably don't want... I wish there was more option for this. Because I don't really, I don't really like the lack of that over here. Water park, fine. It's big. It'll work. Okay. So now I think we're getting kind of the feel for this neighborhood. Still just a little bit off. Let's put in. 
way. So we'll kind of go like this, and that's going to do it for there. There. It at least adds a little bit of something to the edges. Although I wish it would add it to the actual edges and not just, you know, straighten the the bit there. Okay, I'm going to actually have to look at the density graph that I cannot... Ooh, hey. So these guys are ready to go. Um, so they should be able to do that on their own, I would think. Still a lot of demand for low wealths, which is fair enough. Um, so we can actually then get them along the back here. Provided they'll actually build in there. And I think it's time to perhaps at least along the edges uh, sort of get this going for my roads. Because why not? So that's medium density coming through this neighborhood. And the rest of this will all just be low density. Extinguish some fires, that's good. Low density street right there. Uh, We'll have some kind of crossing. I think we'll go ahead and do a medium right there. What now? not keeping up on this. Whoops, hey. Your Honor, some of the city's youths are not enrolled in a school. They can attend some other high school out of town. We put in bus stops. Well, okay. Uh, right now for you, though, I'm more concerned about adding in fire trucks. Okay works there. And I suppose I could go ahead and attach it that way as well. Okay, now we need Polizia. So let's put a pause on that, and then we'll go ahead and put in the French Police Station. Uh, I guess it'll fit okay there. How, where are my additionals? not giving me uh, spacing for the additionals. So I guess I'd probably better put it out this way then, right? Just in case, because it's just over to the left. Boy, I'd hate because this one does. This one tells me where my placeables are. This one does not. Well, I'll put it over to the right, as per the other one, and we'll have a look. So I couldn't get it to the back anyway, so it's got to come over on this side. Okay. Well, we'll just uh, set it up like the other one. And there we go. Uh, along the back, maybe we can put a strip of nature? Can we get a strip of nature in there? We cannot get a strip of nature in there. It's doomed the way it is. Well, not necessarily. We can still fake it. that. And then we'll get uh, something like that in there. Okay, well, fills in just a little bit anyway. So we can't get anything else in there. That works for me. Fire's still blazing. Uh, when, when, yeah, right, so what I was going to do before we were interrupted there was make this medium. Now, I don't know that I'm going to do that for everybody. I would kind of like the uh, the industrials to build up to medium, 
just so it's easier to handle and then we can just technify well not really technify but technify <laughs> um, a little bit easier so that works um, what else garbage garbage is a damn problem okay we need somebody who's got lots of garbage trucks would that be mineral town Out to the region and garbage, and we've got one, one left. Okay, well, in that case, we need to come in here, and we need some money. That's well, only five thousand. I was gonna put an incinerator in there, wasn't I? Well, just do that. Here. And we will send one garbage truck out to there. How many are we sending here? Three? Sending two there. Okay. Works for me. And I feel like that's kind of how that's going to be. We're just going to have to use one side to do one half of Gaslantis and one side to do the other. In that case, Gas Town could power Omega, Coal Town could power Gazconda, Mineral Town could power the rest of them. I don't know. Anyway, back to Suminico. I know this is taking a little bit longer, and not much is happening, but I do, like I said, want to take this a little bit slower. I do want these things to build up a little bit better, um, so that we can actually play thematically with how I would like this town to go. So, uh, let's go ahead and give these guys streets, because I imagine that also makes them mildly happier. Um, we'll start from this side. And the aircraft in this game are incredibly loud. Mineral Town's garbage trucks are coming along. I wish there was an easier way to do this. Would be nice. There's no demand for commercial anymore, is there? I mean, there's elite commercial, yes, but not... Not of the variety that I require. Welcome to Let's Play Upgrading Roads. If there is a better way to do this, I don't know it. So this neighborhood is a neighborhood that I would like to keep this way. I'd like to keep it all these kinds of homes, and so it's really going to come down to getting those apartments to build in. Now, as time goes on, I imagine that there will be more demand for a medium wealth. And that'll allow me to kind of put strips of homes along the back. Maybe, maybe not so much here. I don't know how far they require. It looks like they might actually still skirt along the back side of the rail house. Now that that is something I had originally thought of too, as, a, as I was looking at this and planning out where to get this stuff. Um, if I had left that right here and uh, kind of done it that way, it would have left this outskirt here in low density, which would have allowed me to then kind of put these smaller homes out there, these modulars and trailer homes. So we could have had uh, an outskirting of all of them, and then all the, the homes here could have been represented. I just saw somebody who was burned out. You are. Okay. Eh, I guess not. Okay. So these guys are out of that range. Again, I think that it will build up over time. I might be wrong about that, but I feel like as it grows, the majority of the homes turn the block into things. Well, I'll accept that uh, this isn't going to be that, is it? Well, you know, it, it makes a little bit of sense, I guess, to have some of the 
scrub tier homes. <laughs> sort of. Still looks a little bit of an eyesore for the uh, the neighbors. But I don't. I'm I'm very leery about pushing any kind of wealth or land value this way. Um, because that doesn't actually increase... When I put the trees down and stuff... Does that actually do anything? Let's find out. Because it's under nature, but... See, I don't want it there. What about here? Doesn't appear to do anything. Pure decoration. And nothing else. It gives me artificial boulevards, like, basically. Can I... Nope, I think that's where it's at. I believe that tree now exists right here. Maybe if I go into... Tree land. Hmm. Very interesting. That is... That's where that's going to be. Hmm. Okay. Well, anyway. Uh, so, what now? We're doing okay. Now we've just got too many more low wealth that need to come in. Which is fine. So, as we progress down here, I think I want these two tiers to be the... Uh, the condos, and then we'll have the high wealth stuff right here. Um, and then, like, the high density high wealth, maybe over on this side. That way, we get the McMansions and whatnot over here, and I think that'll look decent. Okay, um, well. So, that means that this is going to become like a shopping center right outside of these guys, since this is crossroads of the high density. I didn't think about that one too much. Anyway, uh, we do also have a few other roads here. Maybe I could do something in the middle here. Just kind of keep that going. You know, the, uh, the AI does not really seem to be playing ball as far as shooting across the more dense roads. That's a little bit disappointing. While we're at it, why don't we go ahead and upgrade this? I imagine we'll want a high density along here as well. Yeah, see, they all just seem to be going no matter what. So, my theory here is incorrect, which is unfortunate, actually. Because I kind of liked the idea of directing the traffic one way. It does not appear to be working. That kind of sucks. So, it looked to me like we just had a whole bunch of a shift change going on here, uh, which is kind of cool. I guess since we're putting these in now, too, we'll go ahead and upgrade these roads as well. Let's see, this way, medium. Again, my whole theory about how this is working isn't working, so... Lots of health issues, hold on. Clinic. Just because the clinic is full, that's all. Oh, oh hey, maybe, first of all, we'll put a thing on. Put a sign there, we'll just put the sign out there. And we'll go ahead and put that there. And uh, we do have one ambulance, which I believe is probably covering everything think, more or less. But yeah, let's go down in here and see. Kind of a kind of a nice little neighborhood as you 
come through and you peek out and see the shining towers of Able City across the way there. Nice quiet little neighborhood. Maybe a little too quiet out here. We've got to, we've got to do something about this. Another park area will take care of a lot of that. But uh, we've already got a bit of an issue. Oh, hey, cool. And now there's low density require or low wealth, excuse me, low wealth demand for businesses. I don't believe. Okay, there is. These little shopping centers here became. So this in particular is actually going to be high rise stuff now because it's eating off of the higher land values here. Mm, not sure I like that. Let's go ahead and put all that stuff in since that's where that's going to be. And of course we've already got issues with you guys. So we'll be putting in that park and then we'll deal with that. And that will be an end to that nonsense. Yeah, this really probably would have actually been better flipped so that it was on this side. This land value alone caused by these, however, pretty crazy how that uh, is extending out this far. Not sure I'm a big fan, but oh well. Anyway, town is coming along a little bit, and uh, all we got to do is put in some parks to sculpt our desires and demands. And just wait for all the people to come crowding in. Got plenty of low value shopping now. And now too many jobs. <laughs> okay. So maybe, if I'm lucky, that means they will start racing towards densifying. Which would be good. It'd actually be very helpful if we get that going. But uh, anyway. I don't know, maybe I should put densities... I mean, I, either way, this whole area is going to be dense. Um, it's just that when these start building up, they're going to be even more so. Because they're going to be high wealth. So these, these ones right along here, and that's kind of what I wanted over here. I wanted to raise land values along here so that they create more of a higher, higher rise downtown. It's just going to be... Especially with these, right next to a big tower. Yeah, I don't like that so much. Oh, well, I guess these will become apartments in their own right anyway, so never mind that. I'm worried about nothing. That's how I'm designing this, right? These ones? Yeah. It's this one that'll be perhaps a little peculiar, but I think once it builds up, oh, hopefully the, uh, the land value will spread over there. Man, I wish you could just get something in there. I don't, I don't like the gaps. I don't like the spacing. It just it bothers me. But anyway, that's definitely enough for now, so I'll end this one here, and I'll see you next time.